Online quizzes are a great way to test your learner's knowledge. Today I'm going to show you how to create your first quiz with iSpring Suite. Let's get started by opening iSpring Suite. First of all, you can choose between creating a new graded quiz or survey. Today let's create a new graded quiz. Up here you can add new questions. There are 14 question templates to choose from. Let's start with a classic multiple choice question. Right here in form view, it's super easy to add your question and some answer choices. You can also customize the feedback down here. Plus, you can add a picture, video, or audio to the question. Now let's switch to slide view to see how it looks. All these objects can be edited just like PowerPoint slides. To add extra content to the slides, select insert. From here, you can add pictures, shapes, special text, video and audio, or assets from the content library. Let's add a background image. Over here on the right are the slide options. I can change whether it's a graded or survey question, plus the feedback, branching, score, number of attempts, time limit, and shuffle the answer choices. Now I'm going to go up here and customize the quiz player. Here you can change the features, user navigation, colors, and text labels. If I head into the color options, I can pick a preset color scheme from this menu or choose my own colors down here. I like this preset, so I'll apply and close. To further fine tune your quiz, just go to the properties menu. Here you can configure main properties, quiz scoring, question properties, question list, and reporting options. When your quiz is ready, go ahead and select publish. You can save it directly to your computer or upload it to iSpring Space, which is an online space for teamwork and collaboration on courses. You can upload to iSpring Learn LMS or you can prepare a package for another LMS using one of the supported standards like SCORM or XAPI. Or you can publish as a Word doc. Today I'm going to publish to iSpring Space. I'll name my quiz and choose what project I'd like to upload it to. Now select Publish. Once the upload is complete, select Manage Content to be automatically redirected to your iSpring Space account and view your course. Now you can share a link with stakeholders so they can review your content and give feedback. Let's quickly hop back into your project and look at how to publish to your computer. Make sure your project is named properly and select where you'd like to save it to your computer. Then go ahead and publish. This will save your quiz in HTML5 format directly to the selected folder. And that's all you need to know to create your first quiz. Give it a go!